What's up guys, Davis here, and today I'm remaking this how to install GTA 5 video for RG Agent J JTAG. Um, why am I remaking this? Is because you guys are like, I don't really know what it is, you guys are just like, stupid I guess, I don't know what else to say, but you guys totally ignored some of the stuff I put in the video. So, um, you know, you guys just skipped parts of it, you didn't add the title update, and then you guys are like, Yo, why is it freezing or whatever when it gets to the loading screen? Because you missed the title update. So this video, I'm not even going to use Horizon to do it. Because you guys, some people have problems with their USBs not recogni recognizing in, um, in Horizon and stuff. So I'm just going to show you guys how to do every single thing that I showed in the last video just better. So you guys can understand it. Because I guess my last video was confusing. But anyway... What we're going to do is we're going to go to XCX menu. Also, you're not even going to need a USB for that, if I didn't mention that already. For this, what we're doing, you're not going to need a USB. So go ahead and go to Freestyle Dash. Start that up. And then once this loads up, you're going to go ahead and put... Uh, GTA 5 the first disc now listen the first disc you're gonna put that in and then once that loads you're gonna go up to DVD extract and you're gonna go to game actually first thing you're gonna go to uh, change path HDD 1 and then you're going to make a folder so make and then you're gonna name it games Make sure, make sure it's spelled exactly just like that. And then go up here, click on that, and then press Y. And you should get HDD slash game slash. That's what you want. If you don't have that, then don't even watch this video. So um, after you do that, since this is the first disc, go ahead and change GTA 5 and press space. And then you're going to press 1 for the first disc. And then go ahead and start copying. Alright guys, so it just finished and basically now what you're going to do is you're going to eject that disc and you're going to put the other one in. Make sure it goes in game HDD one slash game slash. Make sure it goes in there again, and then you can either leave this the same, or you can put like two, or you could put play or something like that. Basically, this is the game that this is the disc that you're actually going to be using. Like, if you actually wanted to, uh, you don't even need to like extract this. As long as you get the um, as long as you get the first disc and get it installed and everything first, then you can just use the disc for you can use the second disc to play and then you can get your mod menu and everything just like that. Still, um, I'm gonna go ahead and extract it because that's what I'm doing for this video. So yeah, guys, while you're waiting, go ahead and check out my Instagram and YouTube, or not my YouTube, but you know, go ahead and look at my Instagram and stuff like that. Check out my prices. I'll be taking orders in uh, September, so yeah, guys. All right, guys, so this is done now. Second disc is done, so we're gonna back out of this. We're gonna go to File Manager, HDD1. We're gonna go to Content over on here. So Content and the zeros, and then over here we're going to go to HDD1, go to games, GTA 5 1, and then content, go over here, and then we're going to press LB and A, and it'll copy over. And now that that's copying, um, I'm going to pause the video and then let that do its thing. Alright guys, so it's done, moving that. 
and that's what we want so um, basically now we're on the computer so you're gonna need neighborhood and uh, if you're doing this at USB you can pretty much do it the same exact way you just figure it out yourself or something I don't know this is I'm using neighborhood this time if you guys have a problem with that figure it out on your own um, as soon as this loads I'll show you guys If you guys don't know how to set up your Xbox in the neighborhood, I have a video for that. How to set up your JTAG online. Check that out. Um, but basically what we're going to be doing now is we're going to go to content on the neighborhood. And then the 16 zeros. And then we're going in this folder right here. 545408A7. We're going to go in that. And then we're going to create a new file. New, a new folder, my bad. And then we're gonna name it 000B0000. Make sure it's exactly that. And now I'm gonna show you guys what I've been doing while I've been waiting. I've been uh, updating this this Dropbox file right here. So, all right. So here's my uh, file that I created. I'm gonna download this. And then let it download right here. And as you can see, I've been downloading a whole bunch of crap for you guys. So you have a pretty good choice of menus. Um, some of them I haven't tested, so be careful with that crap. But wait for that to download. All right, it's done. So now we're gonna drag this to our desktop. open it up we're gonna go to title updates and this is your title update right here if you skip this part you guys need to pay attention if you skip this part then you're gonna get the the, uh, the loading screen it's not gonna load at all it's not gonna say load online or play offline or any of that it's just gonna show that girl and then that other girl in the picture so make sure you do not skip this part like you did last time so uh, we're gonna go to back to this folder that we we made in neighborhood go in there and we're dragging this update right in there and there we go we got it on there now so now what we're gonna do we're gonna go back to retail hard drive and I'm gonna pick the purge 2.7 because the purge is the best so we got that on there now. We're going to dash launch, installer. We're going to load that, and then I'm going to show you guys what well, what it's doing right now. All right, so we're going to go to plugins now, and I'm going to put it. Let's see, I'm going to get away or take away XRPC and then I'm gonna select the purge or basically guys you can pick any menu you want and then put it there or just make sure you got it got the plugin just like this and then you're gonna press RB and you're gonna click X on HDD and you're gonna save it and now we're gonna restart our Xbox All right, guys. So it's booting up. So we got welcome to the purge. You've been authenticated. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and sign into my account. I don't play on this account that much, so don't even worry about adding me. I don't care. Um, let me eject this so you guys don't think I'm like messing with you or something I don't know we're gonna go to games now XEX menu and we're gonna go to games and then uh, if you guys want to clear up some memory now um, go ahead and 
uh, click Y and delete GTA V1. You don't need that anymore. And then click, uh, after you deleted that, I mean, if you got enough space, don't even worry about it. But if you want more space on your hard drive, you can go ahead and delete that. Um, but don't delete this one. Uh, this is actually the, the one that you're going to be playing with. So click GTA V now. And you're going to click uh, default.xex. And there you go. It says, well, let the purge begin or whatever. So, I mean, that's pretty much proof that it works, guys. Um, if you get a fatal crash error, then you obviously did something wrong. Um, like I said, I didn't use all those, uh, those mod menus, so some of them might have to be in a certain plugin, like space. I don't. I don't know exactly. Uh, you, you guys are gonna have to figure that out yourself. But um, as you can see, it says load in story mode. I'm gonna wait until it loads so I can show you guys the menu. But yeah, guys, make sure you check out my Instagram. Check out my other videos. I, I usually make a lot of tutorials on how to set up a bunch of stuff on your JTAG and stuff. Um, um, and here's the menu, you press uh, left D-pad and X to open it and to close it. So, you know, I'm not going to spawn anything because we're in this little place, but... Hey guys, that's all for this video. Uh, rate, comment, and subscribe. Check out my Instagram, look at my other videos. If you need an RGH, contact me, I'm your guy to go to. Um, yeah guys, thanks for watching.